quality. Do you think with a performance like that you can leapfrog Sean Strickland and get the next title shot? I think so. Uh, who finished the rope like this before? I didn't get any punch. I finished the guy quickly. I broke his cheek. So I'm most dangerous guy here. I told that about before. So now everyone knows. How much have you watched Strickland to see his fights, and, and do you think you could do the same thing to him? I don't know what I can do to him, so we will see in the cage. So I'm ready for that. I'm ready for take my belt. And obviously, doing your preparation, going back to what you used to do with your old team, are you in a happy place now mentally? Because you talked a lot about being a bit depressed before, but are you in a good place now? Yeah, of course, I'm in a good place now. I have my family back behind me, so supporting me, so more motivated than ever being before. It showed tonight. Can you give us a message to, to Drickers? Can you give a message down the barrel to Drickers? If he wins the belt, if he wins the fight, he has a fight, I think. So. Drickers, no, not yet. No, not, not yet? No, no. Oh, okay. So be ready. Be ready. I'm coming for you. You said Abu Dhabi. You said that Abu Dhabi is the best place in the world. Why? Yes. Because it is massive, most safety country in the world, so amazing shows, UFC coming here, a lot of different things is happening here for future and for the kids, for uh, life. I've been here many times, now I live here, so for me it's the best place for the, in the world. How did you see the fans and the arena? They're amazing, they're supporting me a lot, so from day one, I, before the UFC I fought here, so I felt that from that time still here. Hamzad, you mentioned you really admired Robert Whitaker. What was it about him that you admired so much? What? What is it about Robert Whitaker that you admire so much? He's a warrior. When you meet the warrior, like, when you fight with that kind of guy like you, you know, so it's always tough, hard, and uh, you're thinking about a lot. So how are you gonna finish your guy? How are you gonna do it? You know, because the Rob is not easy guy to finish. But maybe today. Uh, Thanks God, I finished him quickly, but the guy is from Wario. Tomzad, you mentioned you were coming to Sydney in, uh, oh, you're coming to Australia in December for a press tour. Could we see you return in February now that you have this title shot to fight for the belt against Rikas Duplessis? We will see. I don't know. So it's up to Dana. I ask Dana all the time, he gives me the belt, so we will see. If he gives, yeah, go back to the mountains, work back, so go and fight. Have you ever been to Australia? No, first time that I'll be there. So coming to see my fans. Congratulations, thank you. Thank you. How do you feel about joining Bilal Muhammad and Islam Mahachev as Muslim champions? The possibility of that. What? How do you feel about the possibility of joining Islam Mahachev and Bilal Muhammad as Muslim champions? Alhamdulillah, good. Feels good. It's good for uh, all Muslim guys, you know, young guys, young boys who want to be like Islam, like Bilal, you know. So, uh, I'm too I'm motivated, so get my belt as well. Thank you. 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 Thank you.